There's at least 1,007 things to consider when trying to rank this coaster. And that's why I'd say, wait a minute, you can't just skip to the good part. Well, I guess you could, but don't, because there's a lot to talk about. Ooh, I fancy a funny intro. From the park that brought us enigmatic rides such as Tavern, Talakun, and Mystery Castle, comes the newest coaster. Fly. Wonder what that's about. Fly is the world's first and only flying coaster. No, it's obviously not. Fly is the world's first and only launched flying coaster. Built by Vekoma, this ride opened at Fantasialand, Germany in 2020. And spoiler alert, it's a bit good. But how good exactly? Well, statistically, I'd say it's well faster than Galactica. I bet it's around 60 miles an hour. 48 miles per hour. We didn't shake on it. Two inversions, and it's not very tall. This ride is an experience. Oh, experience! An experience epitomised by the theming. Fully immersed in the steampunk area of Rook... Rookberg... Rookber... Rookbra... Sounds gangster. Every inch of this land is fully transformed, and I'd say it's only rivalled by Disney. And when you enter the queue, it's as if you stepped into a film. I hate to say it. It's just so immersive. Little people. Expert vlogging, as always. I still feel like Phineas Fogg. Or is it Phileas Fogg? My mind's fogged. But as you walk through the queue, you're engulfed by burgundy roller coaster track. You've got hot air balloons, gas, detailed architecture, and whatever that's measuring. Probably G-forces to highlight the stats to us nerds. My first highlight are the launches. Each of them send you flying, like it's handed you a can of Red Bull. Wow, they feel well faster than expected. And the near misses as you dodge, duck, dive, and dodge. All the theming in the area. Leave it in the comments if you know what film I'm referencing. Don't know whether I should say this next one. Finally, it's a long ride too. And spoiler alert, I love that pre-flight sequence. Negatives, only the negative Gs. I know some people found the shin guards uncomfortable after various rides I must add. And as a vlogger, this thing is a nightmare to film. How are you meant to anticipate where that's going? So as you can imagine, FLY is a complete bag of tricks. For that reason, there's at least 1,007 things to consider when trying to rank or grade this coaster. And that alone is enough for it to break into my top 10. The layout is far more interesting than other flying coasters, such as Manta, Air, or the amazing Hero. Sorry, shouldn't even joke about that. This ride is the devil. Theming is next level. It's on the same level as the stuff Disney or Universal are producing. Yes, I'd happily queue over an hour for this ride because it is legendary. We'll speak of this ride for centuries to come. Thanks so much for watching. Subscribe and hit the bell if you want. Ciao, legends. That was good, wasn't it? Please, sir, can we have some more? You don't have to call me, sir. But here's your link. Click it. Sir Punalot would sound cool, though. Each of them send you fl... Get out of my way, man. Rookberg? Rookberg? Rookbra? What is that?